Hey guys, it's M4J here and welcome back to the M4J Correctional here on Prison Architect. Last time out we started building our actual prison. Uh, before then we'd just done like admin buildings and little bits and pieces here and there. Now we've actually got into the crux of things and we're starting to build the actual uh, prison itself. So this is the cell block, cell block A. Um, I think in the future there will be larger versions of this being built rather than just this. I don't know, to be honest. Also, it's quite expensive to expand outwards, I believe. Why can't I expand outwards? Have I messed this up? I swear you could... Oh, I haven't unlocked it, I bet. Land expansion. Whew, that was a heart attack moment there. I thought I'd completely messed up. That would have been really bad. Uh, shall I do legal? I don't know. I think I might do maintenance next. And then micromanage? Yeah. So um, I need to keep raising money. And one of the ways to do that is to accept grants. Now some of the grants we've got uh, inmate health and well-being. So you build a medical ward, hire two doctors, and hire a psychologist. This could be the next thing I do. I think it will be the next thing I do. I'm just debating what I'm going to do regarding infirmary. I think I know where that's going to go, actually. So let's do that. Or prison maintenance, maybe. Hmm. I mean, we could. Uh, I can't do short term investment still. I think I'm going to do this one, because it should be the cheapest one to do. I can increase my loan soon as well, which is nice. But I think for the infirmary, I'm going to put it here. So I need a two gap. So I can build it like that big. That'll work quite well. And then we can put the morgue here as well, of course. That's something I haven't done yet, actually, is put the windows in the cells. So I will get on with that shortly. We'll let this building get built first, though. They are currently doing the plumbing still as well for the cells. This will eventually get replaced as well with all white walls. Uh, blue walls, sorry, not white walls. Because this is the minsec. And yeah, so that uh, let me do this as a high priority. Because I want to get that money in. So that's another, what, 10,000 if I get that done. The idea is to keep this prison profitable, and right now it isn't. So getting this done is, as I said, a very high priority. I should also start looking at like the regime and stuff. So let's go here. So uh, in terms of, let's get them up at 6 a.m do shower and then we'll do two hours of eating then we'll do work slash free time until 1 p.m. and then we'll do eat and we'll do four more hours of work slash free time and then we'll do another uh, what should we do yard time maybe just an hour of yard time and then two hours of eat and then yeah lock up and sleep I quite like that it's not bad. Uh, right, building is done. Good stuff. Let's pause for a second. So I want a white wall along to there. Let's just do it to there. And then door. Normal door. And then rooms. You're going to be infirmary. Which I need to unlock still. Am I researching health? Why am I not researching health? That's very important. So we'll get all the building done. That is building the wall, right? Yeah, good. Uh, and then the morgue is pretty much just going to be this big. And it's going to be like this and like this. And I've kind of accidentally made this room the perfect size as well, which is nice he says. It might not be. Hang on. Planning, objects, 
So is it one, two, three, wall? So it's going to be here, wasn't it? The idea is to try and leave a space between each bed. Which I could, in fact, do. If I was to move this door over, or I could just leave this bit blank completely. I mean, that works. I could just leave that bit blank completely. Uh, and then as for slabs, one, two, three, four, five. Hopefully I don't even need that many, but you never know. Uh, how are we doing in bureaucracy? Health is currently coming. Um, psychology I need as well, because I need to hire a psychologist. So where's the psychologist going to go? I suppose, for now at least, there. Because it never said that you need to have the program with the psychologist. It just said you need a psychologist. Am I missing any staff right now? I need a foreman still, but that comes later. That's not important right now. That's going to annoy me that it's not connected, but this isn't really going to be a holding cell for much longer. So that shouldn't be the end of the world. What else is on the priorities list? Is health done yet? Are you stuck? You're an idiot. I've now got to spend money rehiring a workman because that moron got stuck. I suppose I could have put a door there, but oh well. Um, bureaucracy... I need to check about health. Health is now done. Psychology is underway. So let's get the infirmary. Which is going to go there. And then the morgue. Which is going to go there. So you need medical bed. Which are expensive, are they not? 500 each, yeah, that's expensive. So let's go with just two of them for now. And then slabs. Go two as well. That's all we need right now. Uh, I also am going to replace this wall because that's going to drive me insane otherwise. And then we need two doctors, which cost a thousand each. It's always so expensive. Then we need a psychologist, which uh, I thought I had access to, but not quite. Psychology coming up. One hour left. Alrighty. Coming along nicely. I am very quickly as well going to like, wall this bit off as well, because that's going to drive me insane otherwise. So I'm pretty much going to do it like that. And then fence and stick you there. We need to put lights and stuff in still. Oh god, you're nearly blowing as well. It's going to be expensive, but we need to do it. Psychologist. Right, more money. Nice, nice. Uh, next grant. Hmm. Prison maintenance might not be too expensive. Or just... Yes, this one actually might be the cheapest. Because we literally now just need to hire five more guards, unlock patrols... and then assign three guards to patrols. So, I mean, that's a bit of an expense there, but in a second it should be worth it. I do need staff canteen still. I also need to start... Uh, if I go deployment... This is all min-sec, including that. Uh, this here... Where's staff only? That's currently staff only. This is currently staff only. That's staff only. That's definitely staff only. And 
that, this, 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 and this stuff only. This is Minsec. That's Minsec. That's Minsec. That's Minsec. That's Minsec. Which I suppose makes this Minsec as well. And that. And then all of this. And that, I guess. Okay. So this bit here, it says insecure. And I think the reason being is... Like, there's no fences or anything around it. So if anyone gets onto this, they're pretty much free to escape. Um, I don't know if we're going to be in danger of that, though. I don't think we are. Not right now, anyway. Maybe in the future. Assign three guards to patrol routes. So if I set up blue patrol... Let's do it to there. And then assign... Let's just do that to complete. There we go. So we're going to have one guard patrolling that bit. And then we're going to have another guard patrolling down here. Like so. Deployment. I don't think we need deployment right now. So that's all good. Okay. Uh, I might fire couple of guards again because we really don't need this many. Sack. Sack. And sack. Something else I've just thought of as well as I actually have temperature turned on at the moment too. Oh, no, you're supposed to be sacked. Uh, we, we, we have temperature turned on right now. So I need to put maybe a little foundation just down here with a door that comes from this and this is going to be where our boiler goes and then water is going to go into there and power is going to go into there and then hot water which is going to go to radiators Let's see. Let's have one here. One here. And then one here and here. I think that should be well within reach for the hot water pipe. pretty much going to run like this and I think actually is it going to run like that no scratch that it's going to run through here in fact if I can make it go through the showers as well that would be great kind of like this because it's, it's 50 I think it reaches and that looks to me like it's going to reach 50 Bit I'm not so sure about is here. Is it going to reach to these? Some people might be getting cold showers. Do I care? Not really. Not right now, anyway. They are prisoners still at the end of the day. You got to remember. Okay. I think we're ready to welcome our first residents. think we're ready. Before we do that, I am going to very quickly put a door of some kind uh, here as well. And that's mainly so that people can actually, or workmen can get out and around the island. I might put one on this side too. Because these, these corners are a bit of wasted real estate right now. They could be used for pretty much anything. We just don't have a use for them. So that wall's now done. This should now be able to be moved. No? Oh.
There we are. Now it should be able to be moved. If they hurry up and build the stuff. There they go. Right. Good stuff. So that's a little bit more money coming in from exports now as well, which is awesome. So, what is next on the to-do list? I think we are ready to open the prison and start getting inmates in. Uh, I just do want to check. Is that all? Ah, uh, you see, it doesn't quite reach up here. But we could potentially fix that by having another boiler over on this side of things. Or I might put one up here. Uh, let's go with another tiny, teeny, tiny foundation. Like this. And I'll put a door here. And then utility, boiler, there. Water can come in. I mean, this is going to keep... In fact, that goes across to there, doesn't it? So never mind. Um, small pipe, maybe? I could get that to run across and in. Connect it up with the power. And then a hot water pipe. I don't know where the, uh, the radiators and stuff down here is going to be yet. So I'm just going to leave it like this. I wonder how easy it would be as well just to clone this and then spin it round and have that be the building here. Plausible. Very plausible. Right. Yeah, I think we're ready now to get prisoners in. I might just build... I mean, now, now I've mentioned it, I might just build this final block. Just to really flood the prison. Let's go for it. We are, of course, not going to have uh, all of this. Like the walls are going to have to be replaced anyway, but also the um, canteen is going to be gone, and the serving tables and stuff here is going to be gone. That can always be moved over here when the time's right. In fact, we are going to have to populate that still. That's a good point. I might as well take cell block B whilst I'm here. So actually, what are we? Our capacity is currently 22, and we're adding another 10, aren't we? So that's 32. So it's not worth taking that one yet. It's worth taking something more like prison maintenance. Or security ratings. Probably this one. That's 30 grand. So I could turn this into an armory, except I don't think we have armory unlocked yet, do we? Because that comes under security, I mean dogs, and armory. There we go. That's expensive. Um, but yeah, this is coming along now at least, so that's good. I will start putting windows in. In fact, how much are windows? How big do I want it to be? That's 200. That's also 200. So I might as well go with the large one. I don't know if there's any difference or not. I also don't know why it's got that. Okay, we're going to go like this anyway. So we'll put them behind the beds. Like so. That building's not done yet, so we won't go there. Also, this one's going to have to be a normal sized window. Didn't really think about that, did I? Four, five, one, two, three, four, five, six. That's also quite a lot of money I've just spent there. But yeah, that's going to be a little window there. Cool! Coming along nicely. And then we still got to do the windows over here, but we might leave those for now. Can I check uh, ratings yet? Is that something I can do? Room quality. So they're not 
the worst. 7 out of 15, that's pretty good. I could always upgrade the beds in the future and maybe put a radio in. Um, yeah, I mean, they're not supposed to be the most luxurious. I don't mind. I think it's pretty good. I think it's pretty good going. Also, have I put doors? Oh, I haven't put doors in there yet. That's explaining a lot. Nor have I put a door in here yet. That would have been, whoops, catastrophic. I have got one here though, right? Yeah. And I will eventually have one here going into the workshop. Okay, so that could have been worse. Uh, yeah, this area here is going to become armory, which I may or may not have unlocked now. It's in the works. Dogs is, is up and running though, so I can put dog kennels in somewhere. Where was the chief's office? Okay, so this, this area here is going to be security. Which I do now have. Good stuff. So yeah, all of this is security. Uh, I need to put a large jail door. A white one, preferably. Across here. That's done. That's all done. I will put flooring and stuff in at some point as well, but that's not a priority right now. Office desk. There. We're just going to put a simple chair behind. And then, what was it? Filing cabinets? Yeah. One there, one there. Cool, cool. And then... Um, now, kennel is the next thing on my list. Or a dog crate. I'm tempted to put those in here. Because no prisoner is going to be coming down this way. So which way do these face? I don't know. I'm going to put four for now. And I'm going to put a dog bowl in front of each of them. Staff. Dog handler. I just need two, right? Yeah. And then I need an armory. Which I do now have. Good stuff. Let's get rid of the holding cell. Replace it with armory. And then we need guard locker. I'm just going to put two in for now. A weapon rack, which is going to go there. And then a small table, which is going to sit in front of it. And that should be that done. And then staff. You, is it one per locker? Yeah, one per locker. So once the lockers goes in, I uh, go in. I can hire some staff. And then I need two. I'll put a dog handler per patrol here as well, I suppose, while I can. Get rid of you for a sec and put you there instead. This still says no access, so I need to put a staff door in. Because I imagine there's some stuff out there that we might need to get access to. So that'll be useful. Okie dokie. So, still short on lights. We do need lighting around the place still, which I could still do from um, the wall lights here. And storage doesn't have lights yet. Kitchen doesn't have lights yet. I might put... Oh, I need to put sprinklers in as well. To stop the fires. So we're going to put one above each cooker. That should help with that. A light. Let's go one there and then one there and one there. That should light up the whole room, I hope. Storage, again, might as well just do the same configuration. One there, one there, one there. Could always do the plus shape. I might do the plus shape for the kitchen, because why not? It lights up all the little nooks and crannies then. Nowhere to hide. The yard. We'll do it like this. 
Uh, so what was it? One, two, three. One, two, three. Like so. That should light that up. The cells here. Uh, do we not have power or anything? Oh, no, I didn't drag it over. So what's our capacity now? 32. So it is maxed. Cool. And then um, pipes. So you need to be a large pipe still. Kind of do it like that. I am going to remove this pipe now since we don't need it. Which then means this can go like so, and then this can just go down like this, I guess. Like that. And then for the radiators, are the radiators in? Yeah. Okay, so then we can go down like this, along like this, and then we can just go back up to these showers, which is kind of a waste of um, of piping, but oh well. And then we can go out like this, and then like that. I would make all of that priority, but it's that usual trick of if everything's priority, nothing's priority. In terms of the walls here, you need to be all walled. Uh, you're not canteen. So we're going to remove that, which means this all needs to be dismantled. How much money have I got? 9,000. Okay. Let's put in the uh, the gymnasium. Also, I'm going to fix... Oh, God, I've done that again. Fix the canteen as well so that it is the right size. There we are. So, for the gym, you need what? Treadmills, dumbbells. I'll put table tennis in. That sounds like fun. And then a couple of treadmills... Like that. Dumbbell rack. Like so. In fact, let's do it there and there. Some punch bags. Not that I want to solicit violence, but there you go. Weights benches. Pretty much everything in pairs right now. Um, and then some gym mats at the end. Put three of these. So that's kind of how that's working. What does the PA system do? I saw that just then. Oh, training dummy. No, I, don't, I definitely don't want to solicit that kind of violence. Oh, boxing ring would be kind of cool. Tell you what, let's remove. So I suppose that's a good way for, for prisoners to exercise their violence in a more controlled manner. He says, like, not really sure if that's true or not. Um, so the treadmills, I'm going to put in there and there, shall we say, and then maybe a fan in the centre to keep them all cool. Put some tyres in the middle there. Uh, what else have we got? Tyre apparatus. I mean, that's outdoors only, isn't it? Oh, that's for a yard. Oh, that's, that's for this. But again, looks like it's outdoor use only. So, PA system. Suppresses prisoners by issuing regular reminders that they are, in fact, still in prison. Okay, yeah, we're not going to do that. And I'm quite happy. I'm quite happy with this as a setup. We do need to power the old um, treadmill. That's nice and easy. And we need to light up the area too. So let's go with... I think I'm going to go with just wall lights. 
for this. One there. Actually, no. One here. And one here. And then one here. And here. Same for the canteen. One there. And there. And then one there. And... There. And then for the common room... I guess one there... I can't put one there because there's a phone in the way. So this might be a bit lopsided. One there and one there. Hopefully that's light enough. <clears throat> we'll find out, won't we? So what else am I missing? Uh, armed guard still. Has this all been done now? Yes, it has. I don't really want armed guards if I can help it. But just for the sake of completionism. Assign two dog handlers to a dog patrol. Oh, have I not unlocked dog handlers yet? Is that the problem? Oh, I have them. Why aren't they patrolling? Where are my dog handlers? Something gone wrong here. Oh god, I have no money. Where are my where are my dog handlers? Also, how am I spending three grand a day? I think I'm going to have to open the prison now because we just have no money. We have no money and it's going down. Yeah, I, I don't know where my dog handlers are going. Staff. Why are you out there? Is this a bug? Hang on, I'm going to fire these. And where was the other one? Over here. Why are you there? I don't understand that. Right. Um, exports, we're waiting for a truck to come in and take care of that. So we have now technically completed part of the uh, assignment, but I do still need to do the other two. Please, money. Not now. Not like this. Tell you what we can do, actually, just to um, close this off nicely, is just fill cap to capacity with, hopefully, all min sec. We get nine thousand six hundred pounds for that dollars. Sorry, not pounds. Prisoner uniform is starting to come in, so we do also need um, um, laundry. That's the next thing on the list. I suppose laundry can kind of. I mean, if I was to remove this perimeter wall, this could turn into a laundry room. But then I suppose I kind of want. Oh, you're not watered. I kind of want um, all of the work areas to be connected to the work areas. If that makes sense. Oh, you're not. Okay, you're completely not connected. That makes sense. Uh, so, yeah, I want prisoners to be able to access all of the work areas. So having a laundry like here, for example, would actually be better. I'm quite happy with this prison though. I think this is a nice little prison. Hopefully they don't escape like on this bit, but they at this point they're normally in handcuffs still when they get brought through reception and then taken over to their cell. They're escorted to their cell. And then once they're in this building, they have no reason to leave. We don't have parole right now, so they're not going to be doing parole meetings. Although again, the armory once we have completed this, the armory will be converted into a um 
uh, parole room, perhaps, because it's right near visitation. Although, that's a point. Prisoners are going to be coming into this section, at least, to go into visitation. Let me change deployment for a second. You are going to be staff only. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Uh, and then also, you are Minsec. That storage at the moment is also staff only. Okay. And then everything else I can't really do right now, including all the no access places. Uh, this area here, I guess that's Minsec as well. Yeah. Right. Prisoners arrive in 11 hours. Um, I don't have the money for dog handlers still, so I can't do that. So I think I'm going to end this episode here. And then hopefully when we come back next time, we'll have some prisoners arriving. So until then, guys, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. And of course, if you're in the series so far. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel, be sure to hit... Oh, hang on. Sorry. Drop some comments down below. Yeah, you forgot something. Drop some comments down below with ideas for future episodes. If you haven't already hit the subscribe button, be sure to do so. If you have already subscribed to the channel, thank you guys for your continued support. And until next time, I will see you soon.